So our next hunter came all the way from Georgia. We get a lot of guys from Georgia, but this guy came from Georgia and he came here for one reason. He wanted to kill a monster buck. My name is Ben, I'm from Sanford, Florida. I'm here at Hidden Springs Ranch and I'm here to hunt for a large, typical white-tailed deer. It was on my bucket list, one of the things that I wanted to do in my life. And this was the place that I felt I stood the best chance of having the opportunity at a really nice buck. And uh, I'm excited to have that opportunity. So we were looking through the Reconic picks and uh, I mean, it's like, ooh, there's a buck that we call him Roman. And the reason why we call him Roman is because it's like he's so old and so big, he's got a Roman shaped nose. And we don't know how big he really is. Now, I'm always misjudging, I'm underscoring deer. And on this deer, on Roman, I'm not about to even guess what he's gonna score. They put me in this blind is the best blind I've ever sat in in my life and I've sat in a lot of them. It was a big roomy blind, it's called tank blind. Best blind I've ever seen. I'm here this afternoon with my guide Greg. We're looking over a tank this afternoon. It's gonna be a great afternoon. We're gonna see what comes out. It's gonna be fun. Greg and I are looking at a couple of really nice bucks right now. There's one that's real large. He's not exactly what I'm looking for, so I'm gonna pass on him. But he's probably the biggest buck I've ever seen in my life. But he is a once in a lifetime buck. It's beautiful. I cannot believe that bad boy is just sitting down there. This is exactly why I came, you know, to be able to see this and to, to just to soak it in. It's unbelievable. Oh, you yeah, glad you're here. And I've always dreamed of people to come and enjoy something like this. And there it is, right in front of me. All right, it's our second night. Greg and I are excited. We're going to look to see some big bucks tonight. We're looking for a big typical. It's the right place. We got the wind. We got everything in our favor. Deer are starting to move. Yeah. We're here to hunt Hidden Springs. So let's do it. Look at that. My gosh. We got two bucks out there right now. This is unbelievable. What a buck. Guys, he's moved a little bit. Yeah. I don't want to blow the field. We gotta be very careful about this. You get on him. You tell me when you're on. All right. I'm on him. Okay. Okay. Here we go. You see him? No, nope. I can't either. Did we hit him? I wish we had hit him a little better, but that's part of hunting. And we're gonna do the right thing. We're gonna back out of here, give him some time, and we'll come back in and get him. Yeah, I think it's a thing to do. Yeah, you don't wanna push him, because he's he's the biggest thing I've ever seen in my life. Yeah, he is. Y'all have grown some tremendous deer in here. Y'all are doing a great job, and I'm just excited that I got the opportunity to come out here and share this experience. Because yeah, I've been only wanting to do this for 40 years. I don't know if it's a good shot or not. We thought it was a good shot, so what we wound up doing, we took Ben back, we waited a couple hours, and then went out to find Roman. But one thing we wound up doing, we used Pulsar Helion monoculars for not just for, for nighttime, but we use it for a variety of reasons, including finding down game. Field. You gotta be very careful about this. 
You get on him. You tell me when you're on. Five. I'm on him. Okay. Okay, here we go. So I take the shot. It looked like a good shot. We watch him run off, but we just aren't gonna take any chances. We're gonna give him time. I think that's him right there. Let's go see. Let's go see. I'm so excited. Yeah, let's stop and see where he is. Right there. There he is, right there. He's right here. Oh my gosh. Here we are at Hidden Springs Ranch. This is what we came for. This is what we were looking for. I mean, I don't know what to say about this one. I mean, you can see it. He's a monster. He's a beautiful buck. He's a big old body deer too. <laughs> yeah, he's huge all over. Yeah. Huge. He came in, we had to wait 30 minutes or so to get him turned right, which is very, very important, particularly when you're gonna harvest an animal of this quality and we've had a ball for the last two or three days. Yes, we have. And it, this, is, this is what it's all about. This is why you come to the woods. This is why you spend all those hours. Like I say, this is the biggest buck of my life. And, uh, and I've been doing, I'm, I'm 60 years old and I've been doing this forever. And, and in two or three days, we, we've harvested two really nice bucks. Really good deer. You know, obviously this is the bigger of the two, but the other one, well, I'm awful proud of it too. You know, if this is what you're looking for, this is where you need to come. This is what we wanted. This is why we came. Without you, it wouldn't happen. Thank you. You bet, buddy. It. Great Appreciate deal. it. Tremendous. So every deer that's taken here, we wind up bringing it up and we, we hang it up, we weigh it. 200 pounds. And we process it, basically. And I inspect the deer from stem to stern, as I say. And uh, I'm looking at this buck and I'm, I'm blown away. Oh my goodness gracious. What about that one? Did you shoot that one? What about that one? Congratulations. Thank you. Oh my gosh. That's a big old boy, isn't he? Holy smokes, Ben. You gotta be kidding me. I mean, look at the size of that right there. Look at the size of that. You happy? Yeah, yeah. I bet, holy Cow. He's beautiful. Look at the mass. Look at everything. He's got, I mean. What did we say? He measured 256 or something like that? 250? Seriously. Well, I don't know. Can you trust all these guys? <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations. Great buck. Whoa. The hunt was great. So you had a good time? Oh, yeah, the whole time. It's been and, great. And you shot two bucks. Mm, oh, yeah. <laughs> The first buck you shot was a good one, but this one smokes the first oh, buck. Yeah. <laughs> you know, I harvested two nice bucks. I'm, I'm ecstatic about it. You know, this was exactly what I was looking for. This is exactly what we wanted to do. Great place, great people, great opportunities. Everything a guy like me would want. You know, if you get a chance to come to Texas Hidden Springs, you really need to do it. I know I'm gonna come back. When I look at Roman, it makes me feel really good. It makes me feel like we have arrived. I mean, that's what 20 years ago when we started, that's what we dreamed about. And I always set my expectations high. And we're looking at deer that, that are bigger than anything that we could have ever imagined years ago. I think all too many times people don't stay committed to something. And if they get on the game management program and they stay committed and they're focused, they're feeding the right stuff, they're shooting the right stuff, and they're letting the right stuff live and get old, they will be amazed at what happens with their deer herd. Thank you all for watching. I want to thank the hunters that come out here for allowing us the opportunity to be able to get some phenomenal footage and to be able to participate in their life, to be able to give them a hunt that they'll never, ever forget. If y'all would like more information on hunting opportunities out here at the Texas Hidden Springs Ranch, you can log on to our website, and that is TexasHiddenSpringsRanch.com. My name is Keith Warren, and I want to thank you for watching The High Road. The problem, the problem now is, is what do I do hunt now? Come back. <laughs> I think we may be able to do better. 
Maybe. <laughs> I don't know.